Hello everyone, what is up, it is me, AlbiMTG, and today I'm bringing you guys my 100th video here on the AlbiMTG YouTube channel, um, and so I just want to say thank you. This is going to be kind of a cool little video where I give five shoutouts to five smaller MTG channels here in the community. I wanted to do something sort of special for my uh, 100th video here on the channel, and I couldn't really think of anything too crazy to do, um, so for the time being I'm going to go ahead and show you guys these five channels that I've really been enjoying. I don't think any of them have over 400 subscribers, so if we can get them up some additional subscribers, I think that would be fantastic. Um, and I, I, again, I just want to say thank you. Um, I, I wouldn't have gotten these 100 videos out um, if it wasn't for all the support that you guys give me. You guys, you know, give me all these nice comments and things like that, and it really encourages me to keep going, and I'm hoping that uh, with this video, maybe us as, you know, a community, we can give some help to these five creators and maybe give them the additional motivation to keep it going and continue uh, continue their path on YouTube because I'm really really enjoying their content and I hope that you guys will as well so without further ado we'll go ahead and get into the video once again thank you guys so much for helping me you know get to this subscriber mark we're over 1227 subscribers which is absolutely fantastic and this is going to be the 100th video on the channel which again is just absolutely fantastic so thank you thank you so much so without further ado we'll go ahead and get into the channels here. The first one we have here is Affinity for MTG. Affinity for MTG currently has 339 subscribers. Um, he uploads all kinds of videos. Uh, you can see here his most recent uploads as well as his popular uploads. What I really like about uh, Affinity for MTG's content is that he's willing to speak his opinion, which is very nice. Here you can see he kind of takes um, some opinions that maybe not everyone would, you know, ag agree with or would think of right away. Um, so here he has a video where he says that everyone is wrong about Battle Bond, where he kind of lists off the negative points about Battle Bond, which may seem like not a great video, but it was a very good one to listen to. Um, and it was really nice to see the opinion of someone else who isn't quite as excited about Battle Bond, why they're thinking so. So even if I don't agree with the opinion, I can always, you know, uh, I, I always like hearing about another person's opinion and being able to kind of compare it to mine and just see where they're at. In terms of his most popular videos, you can see here the Challenger decks. He went over which one of the Challenger decks he felt was the best um, when those first came out, and then he also had some Planeswalker deck upgrades here for when Amonkhet first came out, the Gideon Marshall Paragon deck, as well as the Liliana Deathwielder deck. Um, and then you can see he also does some gameplay videos. You can see here Green Black Monsters. This was a popper deck. And then here we have Abzan Panharmonicon featuring Siege Rhino, as you guys can see in the thumbnail. And then down here, just some random pack openings, deck decks, all sorts of fun stuff. Definitely recommend Affinity for MTG. He's one of the content creators on this uh, platform that I always like to uh, check out whenever he does a new upload. Um, I was actually subscribed to Affinity for MTG back when he had less than 20 or less than 30 subscribers, something like that. So it's been super cool to watch him grow uh, over time and I really enjoy his content. I think you guys will as well and for all of these creators if you guys go ahead and check them out be sure to let them know in the comments section that Albi sent you. I think it would be super cool if you guys could, you know, send me some pictures saying that Albi sent you in the uh, in the comments of some of these uh, people's channels. I think that would be fantastic if you guys tweet them at me. I'll be sure to retweet them as well as show the creators that, um, that are in the... Uh, that you're checking out and that you're um, going to be subscribing to and checking out their channels and things like that. I think that would be really cool to see some of those. Um, it would make me quite, quite happy. Uh, the next channel we're going to take a look at here is MTG and Me. MTG and Me does these 60 second crack a packs, which are super cool. Here you can see he has Mirrodin and Chronicles, so they're not just like Dominaria and all the newest stuff. He's going back in time, picking some very interesting sets to open for his crack a packs. And then my favorite series on his channel that he does is his random buys. Here you you can see a zero dollar random buy but let's see if he has uh, it doesn't look like he has it but I was gonna see if he had maybe a playlist of his random buys but if we go ahead and just take a look at his videos you can see that there's several um, so here you can see the zero dollar random buy and then just all sorts of other uh, just random cool content here's a sixty dollar Kijiji random buy by mail um, and then just all sorts of other ones that he has in here, a $10 toy store random buy. So just some really cool uh, random card collections that he purchases sometimes that I really enjoy watching those videos. I think it's always cool to see people buy random collections and then check those out. So uh, I definitely recommend MTG and me if you have the, uh, if, you know, seeing uh, packs get opened is something that you enjoy. Or if watching random buys is something you guys enjoy, then MTG and me is definitely a channel you should check out. And again, let them know I'll be sent you. And then the next one we have here is Chuck Wagon MTG, kind of a newer, newer member to the scene, if I can recall correctly. Um, 
but he does a lot of really cool videos. Uh, notably, he was involved in the giveaway that uh, MTG Strategist was doing, the hashtag WeAreMTG or hashtag YouAreMTG um, giveaway that was going on, where you saw, I believe, Tim Bister was the uh, the overall winner of that. And in uh, each of my videos, he was commenting YouAreMTG, uh, which was super cool of that. So thank you, Tim, if you're watching this video. Thank you so much. Um, and nonetheless, he's uh, Chuckwagon MTG is just another fantastic, fantastic channel. Um, you can see he does some uh, some gameplay videos here on MTG Arena, as well as some uh, some random unboxings, like here a Shards of Alarna uh, tournament deck, which was super cool. I had never seen one of these opened up before until I saw this pop up uh, about a week ago, so that was really cool to watch. So again, definitely recommend Chuck Wagon MTG. Next one we're going to take a look at here is Pat Crack Fever. Pat Crack Fever, under 100 subscribers, should definitely have more than that. Um, he, he also uses the Cardsphere platform, which, of course, you guys know if you watch my videos, I'm extremely, extremely fond of the Cardsphere platform. And uh, Efren from Pat Crack Fever, he uses the platform in such a fantastic way. I highly recommend his Trade and Up series, where he goes and shows you that it is possible to use Cardsphere to send out multiple cards in return for one high-value card. Um, he's got a couple videos up here with this, uh, one trading up video here, one trading up video here, and then another one over here. The series is fairly new on his channel, but it's definitely a fantastic one, and I fully recommend it. He is probably one of the best users of the Cardsphere platform, and he was actually doing the... Um, the card sphere openings before even I was. Uh, he was the first person to kind of do it, and then I came into the scene and started my card sphere story. Um, however, I've <laughs> I've made it my goal to, uh, at some point this summer, upload my entire card inventory onto card sphere, um, but I just haven't really gotten around to it yet. So the card sphere videos are kind of lacking on the channel for the time being. But uh, I, I highly recommend Pack Rack Fever. Um, he's another one where he just makes kind of short videos, so they're nice and easy. You can just watch them really quickly and then uh, continue on with the rest of your uh, with the rest of your video watching. And you can see uh, based on these like to dislike ratios, uh, I'm seeing nothing with less than 100% like to dislike ratio here on uh, on his channel that I'm seeing so far. So um, I highly recommend it. If you guys enjoy Card Sphere, you guys will enjoy Efren. Um, and if you guys just enjoy watching just some other pack openings here as well, some Card Sphere hauls, again, highly recommend his channel. And the final person we're going to be taking a look at today is King of Jank. King of Jank, um, he posts a lot of just really interesting videos, in my opinion, and the way he goes about them, I really like it. Um, he's just a very, very good creator, uh, I think, in terms of... Maybe not necessarily the highest quality content, but um, he does a lot of kind of what I do, where he'll put up some sort of background image so that you guys can kind of see what's happening and what's going on, and then he'll talk over it and give his opinions. And I would say like 90 to 8, 85 to 90 percent of the time, I agree exactly with his opinions. He's a very smart man, and uh, when it comes to this game, um, he posts all sorts of just random stuff. You can see here he has uh, some Merfolk, a Popper deck tech. Um, this one being a Soul Flare. Um, modern budget deck and then just a bunch of just random openings as well here you can see 18 dominaria boosters opened a lightning round where he just opened a bunch of uh, dominaria packs or i believe this is just one dominaria pack that he opened up pretty fast and then of course he was talking about the battle bond spoilers last week when those were coming out so again i highly recommend all five of these channels once again we'll go over them all affinity for mtg is here mtg and me chuck wagon mtg Pat Crack Fever, as well as King of Jank. And of course, if you're not subscribed to me yet, of course, be sure to do that as well. That would be absolutely fantastic for you to do so. I would be extremely, extremely appreciative. Um, and of course, go ahead and check out these five guys. All of their links will be down low in the description. If any of them sound, you know, interesting to you, go ahead and check them out. Let them know Alvi sent you. I think that would be absolutely fantastic. And uh, just go ahead and help out the smaller members of the community because I, I was definitely in their spot at one time before my channel kind of blew up in the last month. I, I shouldn't even say blew up before my channel went from 200 subscribers to a th over a thousand subscribers in like less than a week um, that was <laughs> just still ridiculous and I can't believe that I've managed to uh, get that lucky here on this platform and I'm absolutely absolutely grateful for it um, and I think that all of these uh, channels that I'm showing you here today have the potential to do the same thing that I did they're all fantastic creators and again I highly recommend it go ahead let them know Albi sent you links are down low in the description be sure to check them all out and uh, thank you guys so much again for getting me to 100 videos. This has been an absolutely fantastic journey, my time here on the Alvi MTG YouTube channel, and uh, here's to the next 100. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching the video, and I will see you guys here next time for another Magic the Gathering video.